Where is the evidence that Jesus did not rise from the dead? Where is the evidence that he did not conquer death? Now, this is a crucial question to ask because Jesus rising from the dead is real evidence that he's God, that he is exactly who he claims to be in the scriptures. You know, many religions acknowledge that Jesus Christ of Nazareth existed, and, and there, some of them are even willing to concede that he was a good teacher, he was a prophet. But many reject him as God. They reject him as Savior. But if he really rose from the dead, what is that saying? So my question today is, where is the evidence that he did not rise from the dead? Now, there is evidence, of course, for the New Testament as a work of antiquity. There's actually more evidence for the New Testament as far as it being a reliable manuscript than many, many other works of antiquity. But let's set that aside. Now, I have a question for you. If Jesus did not rise from the dead, and since the general consensus of historians is that he did get crucified under Pontius Pilate, under the Roman government, and that he was put in a tomb that the Romans sealed, then here's my question. Where is his body? And if he didn't rise from the dead, if he really didn't come out of that grave, but all of his followers and believers claimed that he did, then why didn't the Roman government or the Jewish religious leaders, all of those who wanted him crucified, why didn't they go and get the body out of the tomb to squelch all the rumors, why didn't they take the crucified, mangled body of Jesus Christ, bring it out of the tomb, and roll it through the streets of Jerusalem on a cart, in a parade, just to squelch every rumor that he had not risen again? If historically he didn't, then where is all the manuscript evidence? Where are all the ancient historians who write about the fact that they saw his dead body long after he claimed to have risen again? It's an interesting question to consider. 